Welcome everyone to Juno Switch Just Commentary. So someone told me to react to this video. It's showing the tongue, the Thai young people, um, how respectful they are to the culture and of course of Thailand. So thank you so very much. Let's go ahead and check out what's gonna happen. Thank you so very much. Let's see. So this looks like it's the Sankran Water Festival. Ooh! Is it the 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 the, the national anthem song? Usually everyone stops what they're doing when the song is being played. So it's gonna start soon. Ooh. Wow. And these songs resonate to all the area so that persons can hear it. Dad is so respectful. <laughs> that is so respectful and awesome <laughs> even during a very festive moment they still have respect for the culture why she said everything comes back to normal <laughs> oh my god that is awesome much respect to the Thai people for this, of course. Thank you for requesting this. It's a very short video, nonetheless, shows the respect that the Thai people have for their culture, their king, and respecting their nation on the whole. That was so respectful and so great to see. So, guys, we're gonna make a video right now highlighting the Sankran Festival in Thailand. Of course, that um, date and time has already passed. Nonetheless, I'm going to react to this request. While I'm reacting to this request, I'll, I will be eating another meal. <laughs> this is a meal I made um, today it's basically a very simple meal called broth um so to speak so what it is it's basically chicken like chicken this is chicken and uh like banana but it's like green it's not ripe as yet so with pepper and tomato and stuff like that it's it's almost basically just a very simple broth i'm looking for my napkin that's what i'm looking for okay so now we're gonna react to this video of course don't forget to subscribe as i said to juno sweet just commentary thank you so very much let's go ahead of course they're highlighting what's going or what was going on at the sankran the water festival mm. <laughs> everybody have a gun a water gun and shooting at a and I think that thing they're passing on her face is a cooling powder or something like that. <laughs> mm. <laughs> oh! <laughs> I saw... <laughs> That's a big gun. <laughs> I saw a video of um, Bida Saka where they were going around meeting YouTubers and I think she was part of the YouTubers that they met or they brought a, a flyer for. Mm. <laughs> mm. I may not be able to eat all of that before the video ends. So if I don't, I will watch the other video which is called Watch the Sankran. She's got a gun now. <laughs> oh, ice cold water. <laughs> oh. Mm. <laughs> oh. Mm. oh my God. That's a big god. <laughs> oh my 
recognize him now. Ah! <laughs> 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 Come on, Mario. 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 Come on, Everybody's touching his face! Come on, you want to go clear? <laughs> oh my gosh! Oh my gosh, everybody wants to touch his face! Wow! Baby bodyguard! Jesus! Oh. Yo, but. Oh, in Thailand, they have plenty of waterproof phones. I'm seeing so many of the kids with their phones in their hand. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Everybody, we want to take a picture of them. Oh my gosh. If I come here in the Sankan Festival, I need bodyguards because that is a lot of persons. People are so awesome. I don't hit that face, but I'm mad. <laughs> oh my god, that is too much. My gosh. <laughs> no, 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 that was my face. That was my face. Oh my god! Jeez, mm. you're the company girl with. <laughs> wow. I'm in problem, yo. All of you are gonna just fly at my face. <laughs> oh my god, I think I got to my glasses. <laughs> yo, they maybe check like we should not have gone in the crowd. Look at why I'm following them. They are like local celebrities. Everybody is now following the crowd. Everybody is following. Yo, you guys have got a lot of waterproof phones. Okay guys, so I'm now gonna react to another video which is entitled What is Sun Crime? It's more of a listening and learning video, so I do hope that you stick around as I learn about the Sun Crime Festival. I know a bit about it, but it will be a little more, okay? Let's go ahead. Okay. This year, from April 12 to 16, over half a million tourists arrived yeah. in Thailand and about 3 million Ooh. people traveled domestically. Why? The Sun Crime. The Thai New Year, or more famously known as Sokran, the world's biggest water fight. <laughs> It's a traditional but cultural event. A water fight would be like saying Christmas is about Santa Claus. It's just the tip of the ice. Hmm. 
It is a very hardcore culture. Songkran derives from the Sanskrit word Sankranti, which means transformation, or specifically the changing of zodiac signs. Wow. For over a millennium, Songkran indicated the time of year with dates set by astrological calculations until 1940, when the official new year was changed to January 1st. 1940. Or giving food to monks is a common and traditional way to start the holiday. Wow. วันสงกรานต์คือเป็นวันครอบครัววันที่สมาชิกทุกคนได้มาอยู่พร้อมหน้าพร้อมตากันหลังจากที่สมาชิกบางคนก็ไปทํางานต่างที่บางคนก็ก
Wow. That's smart. That's smart. Wow, that is amazing. Oh my god. Did you just feel? My comfort to play, Wow. I know. We have to talk about water use. Mm -hmm. When you promise the world's biggest water fight, you will use a lot of water. Yeah. About a hundred million liter extra each day of salt in only three wow. provinces, to be specific. Although it may seem like an infinite amount, the total increase in consumption is about 2% daily, taking into account that most factories that use an industrial amount of water are closed for the holiday. Real national issues like developing a sustainable water management plan are neglected. The problem isn't about the festival. In fact, turning off water completely would greatly hurt this region's tourist-based economy. The focus should be the big picture of water management in this age of climate change. And because the globe is warming, then instead of just having a dry season, it turns into a drought. Instead of having a wet season, it turns into a flood. Vast flood surge. We are loud and proud to show the world our traditional, unique, and fun celebration of New Year. So let's make sure our grandchildren can still enjoy it. Yeah. And it's not something that they do in Thailand every day. It's only like for, I think, three or four days. It's like their, their way of celebrating the new year. Um, I can well imagine that persons who try to find, um, you know, loopholes to have an argument with climate change and whatnot, which is, you know, I expect it. But as you saw, as I said, they collect the water in the center. So it's like, it's not to say they, 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 they are diverting a river. This is all done prior to the event. So it's, 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 <coughs> As part of the culture, um, four or five days of, of this event, three four days of this event is not gonna suddenly cause the world temperature to drop. Oops, okay. <laughs> but I understand that persons will for sure be concerned in regards to climate change. But I'm quite sure the management team who is dealing with the Sankran Festival and cultural event in Thailand have thought of all that and they took all that into consideration prior to the event. Of course, thank you so very much for requesting this video and thank you for sticking around as I enjoyed the video and enjoyed my meal. Um, of course, don't forget to subscribe to Juno Switch, just subscribe and share, like us on Facebook and follow us on Twitter. If you want me to react to video, don't forget, of course, leave a comment below. Thank you so very much. Bye, guys.